Hello everyone. Uh, my name is Lewis and I uh, just wanted to make a quick video. I was encouraged by a brother of mine. <coughs> Excuse me for my scratchy voice. Uh, I've been battling a little bit of some, uh, uh, I don't know, the crud I guess. But anyhow, a uh, brother of mine in UK had encouraged me, Brother Dan, to make a quick video. Uh, proclaim Jesus Christ as Lord and He is my Lord and Savior. He has been for years now. Uh, I'm not going to say a long time. I mean, I always believed in Jesus Christ. I was raised in the Catholic Church. Um, I've since uh, separated uh, myself from those doctrines and beliefs and and uh, the works of that church. And I'm just a Christian, uh, a Bible-believing Christian. If, if I had to say, oh, I'm, I'm not a Baptist, I'm not a Protestant, I'm not a, a word of faith, I'm just a, a Bible, Bible believing Christian, King James Bible, um, I'm happy to say that I, I did get me this Bible um, about a week or so ago, a couple weeks ago I had ones, but this one I'm very pleased with, it's, a, it's an old one, we found it in real good shape, it's actually published in 1973, but it's a, it's a King James Bible. I truly believe in it. I think that it is the infallible Word of God, the incorruptible seed um, that leads to eternal salvation. I think that we should be reading the Bible every day. We should be delighting ourselves in the Word of God and the love message and the love letter that He left us in this, in His precious Word here. And uh, I can't say enough of that. All the glory uh, and power and the honor, everything goes up to the Lord. Chalk it up to God. Um, I love him very much, and uh, I'm not perfect. I'm not a scholar uh, by any means. Uh, I'm studying to show myself approved. I'm walking in faith, growing in my faith walk every day, um, trying to abide by him. And just in reading, uh, I've been through a lot. I could go through a testimony, uh, but I don't think I'm going to do that on this one. Um, I don't know if there'll be another video, but I was encouraged by my brother Dan in the UK to make a, a video and share with you that, that Jesus Christ uh, is my Lord and Savior. He's the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, um, the Son of God. He was uh, born of the Virgin Mary and by, um, by virtue of, of the Holy Spirit, and uh, he walked on earth, he taught on earth. He uh, established his church, Petra, and the rock, and the solid foundation uh, that uh, his church was built. He was uh, persecuted. He was uh, tempted um, by the devil, and uh, uh, he uh, he uh, he defeated it. He defeated it, as he said, uh, when he was crucified. It, it was finished. It was finished right there on the cross. If uh, if, if there is iniquity in this world. We are in a spiritual warfare. There is a battle going on. Um, whether you believe it or want to admit it or not, uh, that's what it is. There's spirits out there that uh, we need to be mindful of. We need to uh, pair ourselves with, uh, rather, be on the side of the Lord and, uh, and guard ourselves from uh, the wickedness of the world. And it's nothing to be afraid of. I mean, we have nothing to fear. I was reading. I have, a, I have a lot of favorite verses that I ha that that I read uh, now and then, <clears throat> not as some kind of um, uh, what a vain repetition or anything like that. But there are a couple psalms that I, that are particularly uh, stand out to me, and uh, one of them is Psalm 27. And as I said, nothing nothing to fear and, and then it starts off saying the Lord is my light and my salvation whom shall I fear the Lord is my strength of my life of whom shall I be afraid uh, no one uh, I don't want to be like Simon Peter saying that I'll die and, and then uh, you know before the, the rooster crows I'll deny him three times who knows you know, uh, but I'm ready I'm ready. I think that it's right around the corner. I think that it's nigh. Uh, I don't know how much time we have. 
uh, I could go on and on and on of, of um, my firm uh, faith and my belief that uh, that he's returning terribly soon. And I say it terribly because it is going to be a day of judgment. It's going to be uh, a day when men's hearts will fail them for what they see coming upon the earth, as it says in Matthew. And uh, Matthew 24, I believe. But um, again, if you're saved, if you know Jesus, there's nothing to fear. Uh, when all these things, you see it like um, uh, when you see it come upon the earth, that's when uh, you need to stand, look up, because your redemption draw nigh. Think that we'll be raptured. I don't fully understand that. Uh, uh, the way that uh, that works, I think that only, as the Bible says, that only the uh, the Lord knows the the day and the hour. Um, but I think that we should be watching. I think that we should uh, be um, keeping watch, um, being mindful of the times uh, and the signs of the times. And we are in the season, and I believe that everyone should know that we're in the season. And I know that on my Facebook that I post a lot of. Um, references uh, to that and uh, videos to that and uh, things that uh, things that I uh, I feel in my spirit uh, to share and I share it in love I don't share it to be sensational uh, I don't share it to be a uh, uh, to, to cast fear. I just share it in love so that others aren't walking blind, spiritually blind, and that they, they too may have an opportunity to to um, to wake up and to repent and to come to Him with a contrite heart. That's what happened to me. I can't tell you exactly when it happened. It was a series of, uh, I guess, a series of uh, movements of the Holy Spirit uh, that, that that in me and uh, and by virtue of that uh, I became consumed I, I prayed that I wanted to to for him to fill my heart for him to uh, to, to uh, um, cast out my flesh, or however you say it, to, to start chipping away at it, to making me m more towards Him, to be able to, as it says right here, this this probably sums it up, and it's Psalms 27, um, 8, and it says, When thou said, Seek ye my face, and that's the Lord saying, Seek ye my face, my heart said unto thee, Lord, it doesn't say, Lord, but it said, My heart said unto thee, Thy face, Lord, will I seek. And um, that's what happened to me. And every day, um, I can't get enough. Uh, day and night, I wake up in the morning and I think of the Lord. I wonder if today's a day that He's coming, that He's going to split open the sky, and uh, we're finally going to go home. Uh, throughout the day, I'm consuming myself in His Word. There's uh, various pastors and, and uh, people's uh, so-called ministries that I listen to. And uh, I think that uh, they're strong in the faith, uh, that they're honest, that they're humble. They, have, uh, they come in humility before the Lord and before their brethren to share in the love of the gospel. And uh, throughout the day up until night, I stay up until 11, 12 o'clock at night, and then I wake up at 5.36 in the morning and do it all over again. And uh, I can't, I, I, I wouldn't have it any other way. But um, anyhow, I said I would keep it short, and I don't know, uh, I guess it wasn't that short. But uh, I, I, I have a personal YouTube I may create a new one if I'm drawn, if the if the Holy Spirit moves in me and says continue to do it and um, continue to share, continue to encourage. 
uh, and 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 and, uh, and I may make a, a YouTube dedicated to that. I have a personal one with my family, with my kids, uh, and I don't I don't know if it's appropriate for me to post videos like this on that channel for right now. I think I'm gonna post it as a video reply to my to my brother Dan in the UK. Uh, God bless you, brother. Uh, you're strong in the faith. Uh, don't don't ever be discouraged that that he is uh, uh, he's you are pleasing in his sight and uh, I can't stress that enough and uh, God bless you brother uh, and uh, and God bless you for encouraging me and God bless everyone if you don't know Jesus Christ uh, and if you don't uh, know him as your Lord and Savior I encourage you to seek him again it says when thou said seek ye my face, my heart said unto thee, Thy face, Lord, will I seek. Seek the Lord. He's everything. There's nothing on this world, nothing in, in this, in, 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 that man can give you that will totally satisfy you, that quench you. As, as, as the Lord said at the well, that I give you well, this, this water, you will never thirst again. Some, something that effect I could find find it in here but uh, anyhow uh, seek him you will be completely satisfied eternally God bless you